camaraderie, competition, and the game of golf. It's the focus of a veteran organization that continues to grow nationwide, including here in the heartland. 3 News Now anchor Zach Williamson hit the links for Mission Service. This is Mission Service, sponsored by Barry Law. We haven't even teed off and we've already won. We being the members of the Veteran Golfers Association. It's located in every state with members in every state and in Bahrain and Germany now. The national nonprofit has more than 14,000 active members and more than 600 events each year all across the country. So it's a lot of fun uh, for people to get together with people that have that shared experience being vets or families of vets. Golfers compete in flights separated by skill level, age, and whether they are veterans or family members of veterans. On this day, the Nebraska chapter is hosting one of its 18 tournaments of the season at the Players Club in Omaha. This is an example of one of the really nice courses that I normally wouldn't, wouldn't be able to play. While the Nebraska chapter's hosting, it's not limited to the state's 120 active members. Probably played in about five or six states and it courses I've never played at before, never would have played at. Nebraska, South Dakota, Iowa, Kansas, Missouri, um, and then North Carolina coming up. Navy veteran Jesse Schmidt is talking about the senior national championships he qualified for at the prestigious Pinehurst Resort in North Carolina. It's the competition he and other members were seeking. The adrenaline that you can get uh, and the nerves that you can get in the tournament uh, don't compare from a Saturday afternoon round with the buddies. So um, definitely was looking for more experience and, and found the opportunities here in the VGA. This isn't a Saturday round with your buddies. Oh, someone's pen hunting. Yeah. Nice shot, dude. Thank you. I get lucky sometimes. In fact, the bond is even stronger. My second tournament, I, I knew maybe two or three people. Uh, but seven or eight people knew me from the, from the first one. They knew me by name. They came up giving me a bro hug my second time here, and I'm like, this is cool. Great ball. You know, a lot of vets, when they get away from active duty, they miss their friends. They miss that group of core people they're with. This is your chance to have a new core group of people. Hey, that's a great out. So I'll walk into these tournaments. A lot of faces I've never seen before, but... These are my brothers, and uh, it's just there. Young, old, that bond is there. We're, we're pulling for each other. We don't even know each other, but we're pulling for each other. Nice play. Thank you. Well, and Jason told Zach one of the events they look forward to most each year is the Corn Cup when Nebraska and Iowa go head-to-head -head match play for bragging rights. If you're interested in learning more about the organization, visit VGAgolf.org. If you live in Iowa or Nebraska, you can reach out directly to your state's director. The email addresses and Facebook pages are on your screen and also with this story on 3newsnow.com. If there's a person or topic you think we should cover for Mission Service, tell us. You can email mission.service at 3newsnow.com.